Hi, my name is Monica Burns. I'm an ed tech and curriculum consultant, founder of classtechtips.com, and a webinar host for Simple K-12. I want to share with you some tips for how to share Google Docs. So I'm here inside of my Google Docs. I have a new Google Doc open. Um, I have typed in book report brainstorm because this is a document where I want a bunch of people to jump in and brainstorm about some things that we want to see our students do when they are brainstorm when they are writing a book report. So here I am in Google Docs. I have the share button here at the top. In order to share something, which right now it's private only to me, it has to have a title. So notice there's no title up here. It will default with whatever you have at the top. So book report brainstorm might be what you want, or you might want to change it, but we're going to save it for our purposes now. So when I want to share this with someone else, I have a few different options. I can type in their email addresses or I can get a shareable link. So I'm going to type in one of my other email addresses just to show you what it will look like. So I can add a note like a let's brainstorm note here which will be automatically emailed um, to the folks that I share the document with. Now I might want this other person, the other Monica, to edit this document so they can jump into the brainstorm. I might want them just to look and add comments. Like if I have a long proposal or a long report and I want them to just add some comments on the side, not change anything. Or I might want them only to view it. I'd want them to look at it, but don't make any changes. I have these options. So I can go ahead and send this and that email notification will automatically go to the person that you send it to. The other option when you hit the share button is to get a shareable link. And you'll notice down here at the bottom, it already reminds me that I shared it with the other Monica email account. So I can go here and get my shareable link. This is great if you do not want to worry about emailing a whole bunch of people. Um, when it comes to knowing their exact emails, maybe you're responding to an email and you just want this link and you're going to give it to someone in a wide range of different ways. So if I want people to view this, so I want a couple of other people to peek in, I can go ahead and highlight, I can copy, and now I can share this um, link with anyone. Yep, I could put it in an email, I could post it in Google Classroom um, as a response or an idea to someone. I could even connect it to a QR code and someone could scan it and get to the site. So if you want to share a Google Doc, you have the option to do it straight from email, straight from um, the link, and you can edit, comment, or view. 